questions. And you ladies have been so wonderful to submit some questions, but as you come up with new ones, just post them below and we'll continue to... <laughs> well, we'll see how far we get. <laughs> right? Yeah. Yeah, he does have a meeting in, in an hour, so... Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're going to kick it off with, um, was Jesus ever afraid? Was he ever afraid? So I'm taking uh, fear as a negative uh, emotion, uh, which would be sinful for God to be fearful. Um, because once you, once you say that he's fearful of something that was going to transpire, that he knows in his omniscience is the plan of God, then it's sin. And then once you allow that to be um, placed on his character, then, then any other kind of negative emotion can, can be attributed to him. And pick another one. I mean, did he ever worry? You know, worry is not an optimal thing for a Christian if you believe that God's in control of all things. I don't think he ever worried because he couldn't worry because he's omniscient. So once you allow any of those to be part of his character, then you call his character into question and, and then, then he's not God by definition. So um, he, did, he did know what the crucifixion was about in the Garden of Gethsemane. He did pray for the cup to pass from him but it never says that he feared the cup. And on the opposite, he embraced the cup uh, and went to the cross willingly and knowingly. Uh, fear would mean you would run from it, not embrace it. So no, I don't think the Lord would ever fear anything. He was the opposite of that. He's the one who came out of the bow of the boat and, and commanded the sea to obey his word. Interesting, all right. 